So guys, I realize I'm a genius. I did not bother to check the other normal main quest, which I found out was just right over there. Uh, so what I did, uh, I just came back, went to the map, and just kind of explored up this way, and I found where the conquest battles are. So just a tip, if you want to de uh, defend, or sorry, defeat, um, people in a conquest, you get way more gear and experience because if you went with the Athenians, it's a hard challenge and you get two pieces of epic gear. Whereas if you just defend as the Spartans, you would get one piece. So it's up to you. I'll probably eventually do the invading just so I can see all the good stuff I can get and we'll go from there. But as always, I'm Campaign Poppy. Thank you for coming along. Let's go meet this famous oracle. I also got a quest to kill a legendary boar, which is level 13, so I figure I will not do that, and it's probably something that'd be cool to record, so once I'm at a more appropriate level, we'll go back and revisit that. I guess I could call Phobos. Whoa. Okay. So can't take a road to get to the Oracle, so we're just gonna ride up this mountain until my horse gets pissed off at me and refuses to go. Hopefully the Oracle will actually lead me to Elpinor as well. We'll see. I feel like the horses are more forgiving here too, and we'll kind of just go along with whatever you want them to do. Because I don't think this would have been the same in Origins. But correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. Tomb of the First Pythia. What's a Pythia? Should I know this? Did they already talk about it? And I just missed it? Probably not. So there's a lot here. I hope Why? this oracle gives better news than the one in Sparta. And one thing I've been doing too is just picking up all these optional quests. Just, oop, just because I can. You don't have to complete them, but if I ever come across them, it'll let me know. Ah, Amistios. Well, aren't you a sight to my aged eyes? Young, energetic. Perhaps I should just pay for your body instead of your help. Well, I'm not gonna be creepy. Watch yourself. That's not my line of work. Oh, forgive me. I'm amazed the gods would send me someone so well suited to help me, but who is also so appealing to me physically. I'm glad to hear it. Corigos, my husband, is having some difficulties keeping up with my hunger for pleasure. I imagine any man would. Oh, I have many lovers, but he's my soulmate. When we're together, it's indescribable. Then don't describe it. When we were younger, we would run into the moonlit forest, shed our clothes, and pleasure each other until sunrise. Our howls of ecstasy would echo throughout the valleys. That's, uh, that's too much for me. By the gods, woman. I said spare me the details. I wasn't expecting a tough-looking mercenary to be so squeamish about a little fun. What does this have to do with me? I've learned of a powerful elixir, which if consumed will give someone the vigor and stamina of Eros. If you can gather me the ingredients, I can make it for my husband. All right, I'll find the ingredients, if you promise to keep your nocturnal activities to yourself. I have some drachmi, and Koragos has more. If you can bring me some bear scrotum and a deer tongue, I can make the elixir. Oh, is that all you need? Don't worry, I'll reward you well. I'm sure Koragos will be thankful also. Where can I find a bear near here? I heard there's a cave near the sanctuary that a large male bear has claimed. Are there any deer nearby? This is for keys. There's deer all over the place. I'm not even gonna ask where she went. I'll be back it. with the ingredients soon. 
<laughs> age is just a number. I think I'll get this viewpoint and go check out what the oracle is doing. Or has to say. Don't mind me, I'm just climbing. I love finding these viewpoints, it's beautiful. I feel like there should have been a door there. Alexios, isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpinon? Who's this? Just a simple builder. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? Is she left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. You weren't lying. It really is the spear of Leonidas. Uh, I may have mentioned. you showing a bit more secrecy. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did it... You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, Spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand the word of it, but that's why she's in there and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> you were on Kefalonia for too long. This line is ridiculous. Are there always this many people to see the Pythia? These are more than just people. Every city sends a Fiori, or sacred ambassadors, to seek guidance on behalf of their people. The Pythia not only shapes the destinies of individuals, but of the entire Greek world. Imagine what power one would have if they controlled what came out of her mouth. Apollo controls this! Of course he does. Delphi is nothing like they say. Has it always been like this? No. This was once an open and welcoming place. But war changes things. People seek out the Pythia for more political reasons. Prophecies in times of war often stir violent emotions. It's wise to keep your blades sheathed. Drawing blood in that fee is considered an insult to Apollo. Punishment is severe. All right, let's do it.
I have my own questions for the Pythia. But this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. <laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest! <laughs> Alright. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? That's cool. Just walk in looking all intimidating. I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line. Do I look like someone who waits in line? wisely mortal for you have but one speak truth seeker oh man what do i want to do i guess i'll ask where my mom is i lost my mother when i was young i have to find her where is she it's you from the visions the child on the mountain how could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. There is wisdom in your decisions. Any other Mystios would have killed those people in that cave in Megaris. But you held back for the truth and balanced judgment with their lives. But how? No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain, the cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. The cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken. The prophecy is yours. You never answered my question! The Pythia is done for the day. I'm not leaving until I get answers. The Rotatos, they're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She... knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you. She knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? She mentioned the cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? I'd heard whispers. A cult unlike any other coming to Delphi. But I paid them no mind. The Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia... This is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her when she's not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. You know more about the Pythia than I do. Where would she be? When she's not in the temple of Apollo, she's at her home in the Hora of Delphi. I can't go breaking down every door until I find her. The Oracle's home is probably easy enough to spot. She'd be the only person in the Hora of Delphi who can afford to live in luxury. Good point. Where in the Hora of Delphi does the Pythia live? I've heard she lives on the outskirts of the village, but be warned, she will be guarded. 
Not everyone comes to see the Oracle with the best of intentions. Let's I'll find it. where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required. Plus 5% crit damage? Nice. I'm assuming that's what I'm still tracking. Okay. Grand Mount. Alright, we'll head back that way. I'll check out what this area is on the way. Oh, I leveled up. Okay, what's next? Oh yeah, I need to start using that, my bad. I have the reveal secrets. Do I want to do poison? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Oh, I can't. Does it require more? Oh, progress further in the story, got it. You can't tell I like the assassination piece. Maybe that's basic. But I don't care. I should be careful. High security here. Another sleepless night over. Come on. I'll just collect another quest, why not? Get it, friend. Anything a mercenary can do for you? Athens has abandoned me, Miss Theos. I was accused of trying to destroy a shrine, and now I have nothing. I have lost my citizenship. That's a harsh punishment. I was framed. Now I wish I had destroyed it. Or at least had my revenge on the man that framed me. And of course, you want me to kill him. Exactly. He must be gutted. All right, I'm in. I'm putting my trust in you, mercenary. Kiere. Huh? How far away is it? No, oh, it's the opposite direction. Not gonna do it. Let's go seek the truth. Whoa, whoa, chill. Oh my god. Alright, let's do it. Still a little embarrassed that I didn't even bother to check the uh, other main quest before I signed off last time, but that's life. I hope you forgive me. The Oracle is hiding inside. I'll finally get some answers. Probably a good idea to not just ride it on my horse. There'll be trouble if I'm spotted here. That's a lot of protection for the Pythia. It's a mercenary too? Huh. the only one though I'm not that concerned wow 
Wow, that was a really good amount of damage. Can he poison himself? Of course not. that I got that critical assassination. You just hold down Y. Nothing's going to be better than those. I don't even know why I checked. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! I'm looking for my family. And everywhere I go, people are either lying or trying to kill me. You're the first person who might have some answers. But they'll kill me if I tell you. Not if I get to them first. Help me, and no harm will come to you. I promise. All right. But ask your questions quickly. The longer you're here, the more at risk we both are. What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles. I want names. I don't know. I swear. They hide behind masks and shrouds. Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So, all those prophecies from the gods, all those people, you're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. Damn. You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived a terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. Got it. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the horror of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure. But if he is, he would definitely have what you require. Any idea where I can find him? There is a fort just south of the Valley of the Nymph. He's been known to conduct business there. You've been helpful. May the light of Apollo guide you to your family. I should tell Herodotus what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. All right, that was very eventful. Oh, is the Herodotus just right here, waiting for me like a creep? Yep. 
Well, what did the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me, but I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I can't get in without a mask and cloak. It's how the cultists identify each other. The Temple of Apollo is by the Cave of Yea. Simple enough to find. But a cultist's mask and cloak? How will you accomplish that? The Pythia gave me the only clue I need. When I'm ready, I'll meet you at the temple. For now, I'm going to kill Elpinor, Malakas liar. Didn't mean to do that. I was trying to track the quest, but we'll see. So I go from that 7%, 10% percent crit damage. It's one less armor. But I do like that crit damage, to be honest. Wow. Level 12 will be a good level for me. Okay, and with that, I think that's a great place to stop. This helmet's kind of lame looking, but we'll see how I like it. Thank you guys so much for coming along. It means a lot to me. I know I ask this every time, so I'll probably stop soon. But if you're enjoying it, hit like, hit subscribe so that you can see everything that I'm doing. This is Campaign Poppy saying thank you and see you next time.